Okay, so the arm is going to be very similar to the leg. We're going to create a cylinder. Again, remove the subdivision cap to zero. Um, increase the height to eight, subdivision height to eight, and the axis is going to be, subdivision axis is going to be 12. Let's go to the front view. I'm going to rota rotate this 90 degrees, scale it, and excuse me, assign an existing material, which is going to be Lambert 2. Again, reduce their opacity. That's going to reduce their opacity to everybody. And uh, I'm going to reduce it some more. And same thing, we're just going to scale on one axis and then move it forward or move it wherever we need it to be. So I'm going to go ahead and scale this, scale and move, scale and move. Okay, so we're just going to keep scaling and moving. That one's going to take a lot of scaling. And there we go. Wow, the front. The side view, unfortunately, I don't have a bottom view, so I'm going to use my side view um, to kind of model the arm. So in this case, I'm going to go ahead and rotate it 90 degrees. And same story, we're going to scale it and then kind of go from there. Vertex, I swear I know how to use Maya. <laughs> okay, so again, same story scale, rotate, whoops, scale, move. What I meant to say was translate, not rotate. Scale and translate, move. Scaling move. Take a look at the arm. Okay, it's coming along. Let's add some mesh to it because there's some areas that's going to need some mesh. So edit mesh, insert edge loop tool. It's going to be the elbow area that's going to need at least three edge loops. You might want to add an extra one on the wrist and maybe one for the armpit. This one I am going to uniformly scale. Same thing with that. I'm going to double click and just going to scale a little bit. those caps and delete them. We don't need them. Okay, and now some just, whoops, some basic topology such as the elbow or the, basically the front of the elbow is kind of crushed a little bit. It's a little bit more indented. And if you want to, you can actually extrude out so you can get an elbow or just kind of poke this little guy out one of the vertices out and uh, you're gonna get kind of like a like a fake elbow when you smooth it okay in the next lesson I want to combine all three elements so I'll see you next time mm -hmm.